Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Now here is the question. A small particle of mass, small m, moving inside a heavy hollow and straight tube along the tube axis undergoes elastic collision at two ends. The tube has no friction and it is closed at one end by a flat surface while the other end is fitted with a heavy movable flat piston as shown in the figure. When the distance of the piston from closed end is capital L equal to L naught, the particle speed is small v equal to v naught. The piston is moved inward at a very low speed capital V such that capital V is less than less than dl upon l v naught where dl is the infinitesimally displacement of the piston which of the following statement is oblique are correct multiple choice questions are given here options are a the rate at which the particle strikes the piston is small v by capital L. Option B, after each collision with the piston, the particle speed increases by 2 capital V. Option C, if the piston moves inward by dL, the particle speed increases by 2 small v dL by L. And last D option, the particle, uh, particle's kinetic energy increases by a factor of 4 when the piston is moved inward from L0 to 1 by 2 L0. This question is asked IIT Advanced 2019. Here, what is the question? Here, the initial velocity V0 of this particle and it is moving towards to the right side. At the moment, this piston, frictionless piston, moving towards to the left side. So, here, this collision is given in the question that is perfect elastic. Perfectly elastic, it means the velocity at approach is equal to velocity of separation. So here approach, it means this particle is moving towards the piston and piston moving toward to the opposite direction. So relative velocity become V plus capital V. After collide, you know that the velocity is changed. So therefore, let us consider V dash and its velocity. Both the velocities, particle is moving to the left side and piston is also moving to the left side. So therefore, relative velocity V dash minus V. So we get V dash is equal to V capital V and this is transposing now it become V. So V dash equal to V plus 2V. What does it mean? It means in each collision, it means in each collision, velocity is increases by 2V. So here, given option, here option is given, second option, after each collision with the piston, the particle speed increases by 2V, that V option is correct. Now for the finding further answers, we have seen that about this particle is moving towards to the right side and this piston is moving towards to this side. Here, first collision. Now, we go to the further solutions. Here, this particle is moving towards to the right side and piston moving to the left side. And each collision, total time, taken in each collision, here the particle strikes with the distance L and again come back. So total distance is 2L and velocity is V in second. Okay. So therefore, as we know that the frequency F equal to 1 by time period. So V upon 2L, that is the frequency, is the first equation. Okay. And now, here come on the piston. Here piston's velocity is given that capital L. And let's say, here small distance is covered 
dl okay so time covered this is to cover dl distance that is dt is equal to total distance is dl and velocity is v which is the second equation okay now in this uh, time dt number of collision here number of collision let's say n is equal to this is a uh, dt time and the frequency now substitute the value of uh, dl upon v capital and frequency we have already find out v upon 2l okay it is the equation number third now after this n collision after the n collision the velocity is increases let's say dv the n number of collision that is n and each collision the increment of velocities that is 2 capital v so now substitute the value of n from this third equation d capital l on v into small v upon 2l into 2v okay so here v and capital v cancel out this 2 and 2 cancel out then dv is equal to dl upon l into small v now using the property of integration it can be written as dv by v is equal to dl by l now integrate both the side using the limit initial velocity is v not and this velocity become v and here this piston is moving from l not to exactly half distance so l not by 2 okay here very important things here sign is negative why we have using the sign is negative because velocity is increases but length of this piston is decreases so therefore we have using this is negative sign okay now as we know that integration of 1 by x dx is equal to log x so this property we have using log v to the base e upper limit v lower limit v not is equal to minus here log l to the base e upper limit l not by 2 lower limit l not here put the value of limit v minus log v not to the base e is equal to minus log e l not by 2 minus log l not to the base e here the property log m minus log n can be written as log v by v not here multiply by minus sign minus log l not by 2 minus minus plus log l not okay now again here the property is using log l not upon l not by 2 upon of upon reaches in numerator so log v upon v not log here l not l not cancel log 2 so v upon v not is equal to 2 then v equal to twice of v not so here the velocity is become double of initial velocity it means we know that kinetic energy is directly proportional to the v square so its velocity become four times kinetic energy is increases four times so our option last option that is uh, kinetic energy become four times so here option b and d is correct i hope so you understood this question thank you for staying till the end of this video definitely when you will become success full contribution goes to your hard work but if my videos my lectures my questions will help in your success i will consider myself lucky please like share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students thank you once again take care bye bye